You know, because it could have been we, we, right along the lakefront. We had some clouds. We had some sprinkly, drizzly weather early, and then we had the skies kind of clear a little bit. We had some sunshine, so it was nice. A little bit on the breezy side. I think we also had some uh, cooler temperatures that stayed with us, so a little bit blustery at times. That's not going to go away immediately, but we will start to see some changes. Now, there are some clouds that have filtered back in, and I think that that will be the case at least for the next uh, day or so before we finally break into a good bit of sunshine. There's a live picture uh, looking to the west. Maybe a little bit of a southwest component there. The airport uh, in the picture. In fact, I've been watching this frame and you can see some of the planes land. Of course, it doesn't do it when I want it to, but uh, I have been watching that. Well, also, we're noticing a little bit of clearing back to the west. There's still some clouds here in play, but uh, at least we're able to see some sunshine. And that was pretty much the case for many of you during the course of the day today. This is the cloud cover that's starting to filter back in. Notice there is a little bit of moisture with it as well. I think we'll continue to pick up a little bit of moisture off of the lake also. So for tomorrow morning, there may be a little bit of sprinkler drizzle yet again along the lakefront. Nothing widespread, nothing that's going to cause too many problems, but it will be a little bit of a gray day for your Monday as well. 57, that's where we sit currently, but the temperatures are expected to continue dropping, especially if we get any clearing. There's a little bit of that moisture that I mentioned. Notice it's not widespread. It's going to be very light. If anything, if any of this even makes it to the ground, uh, and then you could see a little bit of sprinkle or drizzle before the sun comes up tomorrow right along the immediate lakefront. This is a little bit of moisture coming in off of the lake. It may be more of uh, low cloudiness or maybe a little bit of mist along the lakefront more than anything else. But starting into the 40s for tomorrow before we warm back up only into the 50s. Unfortunately, the cloud cover and the north winds are going to keep the temperatures on the cooler side. So we end up pretty much where we've been over the past couple of days. But I promise you there are some changes on the way, especially if we can move these clouds out of here sometime late Monday and into your Tuesday. It may start us out with a cool start on Tuesday, but we do expect a warming trend with some sunshine returning to the forecast. So lows into the 40s to near 50 degrees and then expecting temperatures to warm up beyond that. Only mid 50s for tomorrow. Again, the north winds and the cloud cover here. That's kind of a recipe for temperatures to stay on the cooler side. And then beyond that, look at this sunshine returns back into the mid 60s and we stay in the 60s for a few days, but we are cooling down as some rain does return on Thursday. I actually adjusted the rain chances just a little bit. Looks like a bit more of a signal of some scattered showers on your Thursday before we cool it down. Uh, for uh, next weekend. Okay, Rob, thanks so much to you.